Aloha, everybody. The name is Roya. And I'm um, not really doing any segments until later tonight. Uh, so if you have been checking my Twitter profile, which is where I'm doing all the updates now, you would know that Sonic Hedgehog 2 Part 2 is obviously next. After that, I'm finishing up Super Back to the Future 2, then I'm tackling Super Donkey Kong Country, whatever is remaining. Extra videos for Super DKC, I'll probably do like a crossover of the GBA game, but that won't be for a while if they actually don't own the GBA version on me, so I'll have to download it sometime soon. It, the extra video will not come for a while. Nevertheless, um, I've got midterms today. I don't think I'll be doing anything more than just the remainder of the Super Back to the Future 2 material later tonight, along with Sonic 2 Part 2. In fact, it's like, um, it's 2.48 in the morning right now, so, yeah. I actually woke up some time ago. It's, it's all good. <laughs> I'm tired. <laughs> I'm not really tired because um, I woke up at like I'm thinking I woke up at one fifteen, maybe one nineteen. I have no idea. I didn't check the clock when I woke up. But yeah. So overall, I really have nothing more to do. Um, I will try to record Sonic Two Part Two later tonight, guaranteed. I will definitely try to record um, the remainder of Super Back to the Future 2 that I didn't do. Uh, I know for a fact that I haven't done Worlds 5, 4, to 6, 2, which are... I'm surprised this game is actually pretty dang short. It's just that if you time your movements wrong in the game, you're going to die a lot. Now remember, I'm playing the game blindly, and if I'm playing this and I'm not really dying so much, this... <coughs> This is actually a pretty good game in terms of difficulty if I'm not really dying that hard. But trust me, this game is hard if if you've played it as much as some people have, and you haven't played it at all, then you'll think, mm, yeah, it's going to be a bit difficult for me. It's not that difficult, it's just tedious. It's tedious work. Wish they put in more enemies. That's the only. That's my only flaw with the game. <laughs> Um, as for Super DKC, I am in the Factory World, World 5, and I am having a trouble beating it with one chance. Like, legitimately. You've, you you know that from the videos that I've been doing that I'm beating the videos. I mean, beating the videos. I'm, I'm trying to beat the worlds on one chance now. That way I don't end up having to worry about any other problems. <laughs> I mean, trust me, if you... If you saw the hassle that I had to do with World 4, just to get all the barrel shots right, I probably had to do like 192 takes before I even got it correct. It was not fun. <laughs> so yeah, those are your Let's Play updates. Aside from that, I don't really believe that I'll do World 6 immediately for, for Super DKC. The Mario 2 footage is already ready. <laughs> Mario 2 for both North America and Japan is complete. So, don't worry about that. Uh, however, I won't be uploading that material until I'm done with Super Back to the Future 2, Sonic 2 Part 2, and Super DKC Parts 5, 6, and possibly 7 if the King K. Rule battle goes a bit over, a bit over time than I expected. But aside from that, that's really the entire update on that. Um, also, uh, I was, I have some material for an uneven Royal Rockwood number five. And spoiler, it's based on a song that I created. You probably already know what it is. Let's just say it has something to do with Marky Jester. <laughs> that, that's the biggest enough hint to find out what this is. But yeah, I've got no more to say. It's... It'll be a fun ride. But yeah, I've got midterms in the morning, so, uh, yeah. I really can't really do too much work at this time, only because of the fact that I have to prepare for 
Well, I don't really have to really prepare because my art midterm is really just for putting glass onto a piece of onto a piece of plaster, and then um, my English class is simple. It's about the devil and Tom Walker, which apparently is actually pretty dang easy to be honest. I didn't expect that listening to the devil and Tom Walker or reading it and then studying it more. Uh, it, it's just too simple, too simple, too easy. With that said, uh, midterms will be an easy ride to the park. After this, I've got a chemistry test, um, something in my computer class, which is actually pretty easy. It's just a little mini Excel work. Surprisingly enough, it's only 10 questions. Yes, how can a midterm only be 10 questions and yet they're all easy? <laughs> can you believe this? We're actually play. I mean, not playing. We're actually doing a midterm that's only ten questions and is super ducking easy. I've never had a midterm that was so easy before. <laughs> I bet people such as Clement, Joshua Adams, and Ash, or Doug, in that matter, never really had that trouble. <laughs> but I digress. Afterwards, then I have a study hall, which basically free time. I don't really have to go to school on Tuesday until like 11:30. <laughs> well, actually, no. I still have to go in because my chemistry teacher, Mr. Carrot, uh, will be having my notebook, and I will need that for my F period class because it uh, has all the material. Yep, I use multi genre notebooks. Like I have like three and four subject notebooks, so. Long story short, I actually have t I actually have to take time and like study the material from each subject. Algebra two definitely I'll have to deal with this a lot because algebra two is the only class I'm having real real trouble in. It's just because the tests. If I was actually and also the the book that we were given. We're using Prentice Hall, not like Duggle Little or any kind of Holt Algebra Two. I mean, I have my old Holt Algebra Two, but it's under the bed. And I don't want to. I don't. I don't want to dig down there because uh, then my room would look much more cluttered than it already looks. <laughs> if you take a look at my room right now, I've got a whole bunch of books and wow, I've got a lot of folded pants on the side. Of... There's a chair next to my bed that has a whole bunch of folded pants. Pretty awesome. But yeah. <laughs> Um, hmm. After that, though, everything will go as planned. I do expect to finish up Super Back to the Future 2 and Part 2 of Sonic 2, as I said, tonight. That will be done tonight. Super Back to the Future 2, I'll probably upload daily until it's done. I only have four more segments to go through that. So, that will be... That will happen when it happens. Super DKC will happen when it happens. And Sonic Eraser, I honestly don't know what I'll be doing with Sonic Eraser. I definitely will turn it into a, into a Let's Play, but I'll look at that game later on. And I don't want to deal with that until I'm done with, like... Until I'm 100% done with Sonic 2. Only in terms of story plotline. I mean, okay, Sonic Eraser doesn't really have a plotline per se, but... You know me, I like to input the plotline a little bit and say it's between Sonic 1 and 2, or between 2 and the Game Gear version <laughs> of 1, obviously. But yeah, I'm tired, I want to get the Sonic 2 footage ready, so that is what you'll be seeing next. An uneven Royal Rockwood 5 will come out after I'm done with Super Back to the Future 2. That's just another mini update, <laughs> but that's just me. I, I'll I'll tell you the schedule and entirety in the description. So, nevertheless, I shall see you for part two of Sonic Two. That's promised. Doodles.